CMS leaders tonight worked on funding district priorities for the upcoming year. An initial report highlights some of the district's most severe needs, which total more than $126 million. WCNC Charlotte's Tradisha Woodard walks us through where that money could go. Charlotte Mecklenburg school leaders say the 2024-2025 budget report focuses on the most critical needs. That list has come to $126 million. One of the things mentioned in the report includes raising the district's lowest paid position to $17.25. They say that would also include rewarding employees for years of service, totaling up to $37 million. Out of the $37 million, I think it's probably only um, about $2 million to get to $17.25. So getting to this 1725 is not that expensive. What's expensive is then rewarding our long term employees for the years of service that they have acquired that we have not rewarded in the past. Other investments would pour millions towards sustaining operations with school resource officers, accommodating student growth and prioritizing delayed maintenance to another 30 schools. That maintenance alone totals 54 million. So if you take our 184 schools, the, the 30 most severe are the ones that are in the bond package, and then the next 30 are the ones that are identified in this facility condition assessment. As for what's next, a budget recommendation will be made later this month with a public hearing for the proposal set for April 9th. Trudy Woodard, WCNC Charlotte.